Okay, this is a quick how-to video for day three of distance learning. So you're going to go to your day three, either that's Tuesday or th Thursday, whichever group you're in. But this is day three, okay? So in day three, you're going to have um, three different tasks. I want you to take a survey. Um, and you'll have to sign in with your Microsoft account to get to it. Uh, west dash Fargo dot K twelve dot N D dot US. Boom. And then I'm not gonna type in my password, but pretend you typed in your password, okay? And I think I have it up here somewhere. Or maybe I'll just go to the you guys can't be knowing my password. My, wait, wait, Microsoft. Microsoft. Forms, that's what it's called. Okay, but it'll take you, when you sign in, it'll take you to something that looks like this. I'm gonna open up the class survey. Um, and it'll ask, ask you a few questions about school and what I can do to make things better for you, a little bit more about you so I can get to know you. I don't really get to see you a whole lot in class, so this will be important for me to talk to you about the important things in classes and all that, okay? Um, next, let's go back to our app. Okay, so you'll finish that survey. That's task one. Task two um, is to just finish your annotation. Now some of you are reading and writing on Darlene's story. Same exact thing um, as my name is Jorge. You'll click on it and it should take you to the assignment so you know exactly where it is. Okay. If it doesn't work, please let me know. If that task two link doesn't work, please message me on Schoology ASAP. So let me know that it's not working. Um, remember, when you are in here, you need to come back to this page and click the submit button. Okay, it should be around here somewhere. Or maybe over here. I don't remember where. But um, you need to click the submit button and make sure it's turned in. Okay. And then lastly, I want you to keep that um, document open. So here, let me show you. So you'll have your, your text open, right? It's open in the app or not open an app or not okay so here's what I would do instead um and those of you who don't know this the app sometimes doesn't work for Schoology I like to use the browser so either Safari or Chrome and I like to log into Schoology that way it works so much better um so you'll go here we're in our day three. Okay, my name is Jorge. Or it's the Darlene story if you're in my read 180, okay? Um, so we're gonna click on the document. And I actually wanna open it in the app. How do I do that? Hmm. Editing, maybe click on there. Open in app. Boom. Okay, just give it a sec. Oh boy. There, okay. So, to do a split screen, I actually pulled up right here with my finger really slowly and I can see here, and I can get a split screen if I hold this and hold it and drag it over to the side here. So then you can have your text, uh, let me see here. I wanna go back to Schoology, there we go, okay. So, oh, whoops, too far.
So uh, there are a few questions I want you to answer after we're done annotating. After you've written all of it, you've read all of the text, there's some questions I want you to answer. And all you have to do is click on it. And yours will look different here um, because, um, but you'll click on it and it'll have a bunch of questions for you to answer about the text, okay? Please write in complete sentences and try your best. Um, if we don't do well on it, that means I, I need to do something different, okay? so. Remember, mistakes are good. All right, let me know if you have any questions.